Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to a new episode of Bramble. This is part five. Thank you so much for joining me. Little Ollie, just bless you. <laughs> he just did a sneeze. Anyway, we, uh, I think we're on the right track to where we need to go. Uh, we're trying to rescue the baby still, I believe. So we're just kind of making our way downtown, I guess. Hope everyone's having a great day today. Um, should I go this way? Guess it looks safe. Ish. <laughs> Who am I kidding? Ain't nothing safe out here. There's a drop off there. Yep. Oh god, don't float away from me. Okay, now where do I go? Oh, it looks like there's some wood down here. You gotta look like really, really close to see. Lighting in this game is done really well. Uh-oh, are we sinking? Ugh. Uh oh, where's the next one? Oh, here it is. I feel like we're on the path. I can still hear the baby. Okay, where are we? Uh, why do I see some feet dangling back there? Oh, for the mother of God. This doesn't look good. Back the fuck up. That's right. Birds don't want a piece of this shit. Oh, what do we gotta do here? Okay, are we killing it? Why are we setting it free? Oh shit. Oh God, now we have done it. Uh-oh, what's that? Uh-oh. Oh, it's a baby. Hey, baby! Oh, oh shit, what is this? Uh-oh. Oh my god! What? What the f- Okay, retry. You gotta hit these circles like perfect. Back the fuck up. Uh oh. I'm so scared right now. Oh, is it coming behind me? Okay, it's the baby. Uh oh. Oh god, there it is. Did I do it? We did something. All in all, that was not a bad fight. I did die at the very beginning there. I thought, <laughs> I didn't know you had to, I thought you could just shine the light and that would take care of the problem. But you actually gotta hit those little circles. Well, we're still making our way. Let's go. Did we save the baby? I'm not sure. All I know is I want out the swamp. I kind of missed the forest. Okay, we made it to land. Um, clear the way, Bramble. Trying to make my way through. Oh, there she is.
Oh, really? Look, I've watched enough Supernatural to know that's not going to ward me off. Uh, can we not go to the house? I guess it's probably going to be locked. We're going to try it. No, she's locked up in there. Nothing on the boats. But now the boat's unlocked, I guess. Oh, that's what we're trying to do. Okay. We got to go back. Okay, so what's on the boat, though? Oh, it's okay, so we can get on the roof from there. Kind of like just to climb over. I don't think anything's back here, though. Uh-oh, music's pumping. Oh, the bramble's closing. Come on, little Ollie. Run. Run as fast as you can. Make way. Make way. Oh, shit, it's right behind me. And we barely escaped. Okay, so I know we can't swim. That's why the water is really tricky in this game. Because it's like, I want to jump to there, but the next thing you know, you're like dead. <laughs> we'll try it. Oh, there's something in the water. Did you guys see that shit moving? Oh, we're going to have to be fast. Oh, get up on the rock. Oh my god, he almost got my legs. I don't know what that is. I hate stuff like this. Go, 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 go. Okay, we need to get across. No, I don't have any more gnome friends to sacrifice. <laughs> Uh-oh, I can't get up the ladder? Oh, am I supposed to jump over? Hold on. Let me see. Drop down. Uh-oh, not like that. I can't jump backwards either, so I'm not... Oh shit, I can't jump backwards. Alright. We're gonna have to make a break for it. I don't see any other way around. Let's go. Go, Ollie. Go, Ollie. Go. Go, Ollie. Go, Ollie. Oh, go, Ollie. Get up. Jesus Christ. So close. Yo, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Oh, we made it, I think. I don't know. Is there a path? Can we, like, not go in the water anymore? Okay, I think we gotta go. Wait, was that a piece of wood over there? Uh-oh. All right, let's go. Oh, this is so painfully slow. I don't think we're being chased anymore, but my god. Oh, what is this? Uh-uh. Back y'all asses up. Back up.
Uh oh. It's like a maze. <laughs> this is fucked. This is super fucked. Why do I feel like her ass is about to come back to life off the tree? Hey, um, do you need a hand? You know, I'm just gonna mosey on by. Of course, the camera angle will pan right to her eyes. Hopefully, the baby's still alive. I don't know what this is. Kind of scared to look. All right, so we're just going to say that's a baby doll. Yeah, I could see that being a baby doll. Quote unquote. Wait, he's still good? You know, I, I played some uh, messed up shit, but this game is really fucked. Ulla had been too late. At least he could give the child a proper burial so that it would not become another dark soul. I love how he's like walking with his arms folded, like, man, we've seen some shit. This kid's never gonna be right in the head when he makes it back home. The slow walking movement makes me feel like something's about to pop off. a light in the darkness. Guilt and sorrow weighed him down, but the warm glow felt comforting. Hmm. Hey man, I've seen some fucked up shit. Can you help me? <laughs> Follow the light, Tuva had said, and he trusted her. What happened to the light? Oh, there he is. Hold on, man. Wait a second. Don't leave me. The Lichtgubbe was older than the mountain. Almost as old as the world itself. He was the keeper of secrets. The gatherer of stories. The light that blinds. Oh my god. What's up there? Long ago, there was a peaceful kingdom that lacked an heir to the throne. King Nils and his queen Magdalena had waited for a long time. And at last, she was expecting a child. She gave birth to the longed-for son, and they named him Ulrich. But suddenly, doctors crowded around the queen's bed. Uh oh. Magdalena succumbed to the labors of childbirth. The love of his life was gone. Man, I would have to be really hard. Weighed down by sorrow, King Nils approached his autumn. Meanwhile, 
Ulrich grew into a young boy full of life. The prince was the only thing that kept the darkness at bay in his heart. One day, Prince Ulrich fell ill. The doctors tried everything, but he grew weaker and weaker. They told King Niels about a mythical flower that witches were rumored to use to heal any illness. King Niels searched the whole kingdom for the flower to no avail, and his campaign soon became a gruesome witch hunt. Oh damn, he done turned brutal. His path was lined with the witches he had slain, but the flower was nowhere to be found. So this guy turns into, you don't give me a flower, I stick a knife through your face kind of guy. Hmm. Don't grow. <laughs> we don't want to grow up to be like him. All right. Pretty dark tale. What else we got around here? I think that's pretty much it, Han. I want to kind of look around before I move because I'm sure I've missed some stuff in the game already. Nothing back here. All right. Hold on, I want to get right next to this guy. He's my protector. Where'd he go? Ulle wished he could stay in the warm light of the library. But he knew that he needed to reach the mountain and find Lillemur. I guess he's kind of showing us the way. All right, fam. See you around. Suddenly, he heard a familiar voice. Follow me, little brother. I will protect you. Uh, it feels like a trap. <laughs> well, we're going. Wait up. I don't think this thing's friendly. <laughs> of course not.
Ollie's had enough of this shit. Oh god, this man just whooped out a sword of light. He's killing it, fam. Straight for the heart. Come on. You bitch. Give him back, my sister. How are we supposed to get to her back? Go, little Ollie, go! Oh, come on, Ollie. Get this bitch. I don't feel any pain, any remorse, any regrets. She deserves all this. I guess at some point we have to stop pressing X. <laughs> I don't know. Should I stop? Okay, let me stop.
Olle, what have you done? Tuva's voice called out to him. What do you mean? I killed the bitch that was trying to kill me. 